okay guys assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh my name is Eva Listian I want to tell you about my story the story is the winner first I want to be able to define myself then in junior high school I take part in the pencak silat extra pulipulat the first time I practice pencak silat my body was tired and bruises but I still regularly attend the material arts training and then I like pencak silat because I practice too I like pencak silat in the morning, afternoon, and evening because I was too busy with my new hobby my mother forbade me practice pencak silat for reason that school disturbed with my learning at school in the afternoon, the weather was cooling, and then the rain fell. But we still practice martial arts. And after training the fighting technique, continued with a fighting simulation. Fight with my senior during the same simulation. I sleep. Then find that after I realized I felt dizzy and there was a lump in my head. My mother, who knew this immediately, immediately got angry and criticized me for not practicing martial art anymore. Even so, I keep practicing and exercise. Luckily, I have a father who supports my hobby. My father always asked me to practice martial arts diligently. I was fortunate to have a friend at the school who supported me to practice martial art. I'm able to be a great fighter, a shiver, and boss of everyone. I also have new friends, that's where I complain and share about Sila. Finally, my hard work, my efforts, my training, my tightness were a bit of a harvest. I was chosen by my coach to represent the school at the city level. After being chosen as the school representative, I had a portion of my training. Many small accidents that I often experience during training. For example, skin torn and then bleeding, bruised body. I didn't stop me, I just enjoy it. The event start. I entered a female class whose weight was 43 until 45 kg. In the event, I forgot to ask my parents for their blessing so that when they walk in the arena, I don't apply everything the coach told. I lost focus. I feel there is an identity in me. After the match, I will not be lucky enough to win. I don't care about the people around me who look at me. My coach gives encouragement and motivation. My body feels weak and helpless to see this reality. I thought that all my training was in vain. The next day, there was news that there would be a level martial arts event. My coach trusted me to take part in the event. One day, one of my best friends gave me and reason to not give up wanting to me to practice martial art again. Her enthusiasm made me get up and practice more. I was stopped when the coach chose me, but my best friend assured me that I could. I also have to be sure of my abilities. I prepared my abilities and mentally. My efforts and hard work about 70% and the rest is prior. Silat even began. This time before I arrived, I didn't forget to ask the blessing of parents to fight in the arena. In the arena, I did well with the winner last year. I was anxiety, but I'm sure I can. In the first round, fever points then hurt. In the second half, we are the same. And the last minute, I dropped my enemy. Finally, I won. I won and broke home a medal. 
now my enemy and I became the good friends and finally thanks to that victory I was allowed my mother to practice mar martial art not only that I also trained stu student in junior high school thank you to be sure of my abilities I prepared my abilities and mentally my efforts and hard work about 70% and the rest is prior Silat even began this time before I arrived I didn't forget to ask the blessing of parents to fight in the arena in the arena I did fall with the winner last year I was anxiety but I'm sure I can in the first round fever points then her in the second half we are the same and the last minute I dropped my enemy finally I won I won and broke home a medal <laughs> now my enemy and I became the good friends and finally thanks to that victory I was allowed my mother to practice mar martial art not only that I also trained stu student in junior high school Thank you.